Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'd like to talk about something very important when you're moving from your previous country to a different country. And nothing is as important as internet, internet connection. Well, the way that I look at it, I think almost everyone has internet connection either in their homes or on their phones. I mean, we can't really carry our house around, nor can we always be at work so that we can get internet connection. So most of the time, we are reliable, our internet capability relies on our mobile phones. Now moving from a different country, or to a different country, you know, th that's one of the obstacles that you need to overcome. Now, I moved from the Philippines previously, I was, or, or I was tied up with SMART, I had a SMART plan, and now while I'm in Auckland, there were a range of choices that I could um, choose from, like Sun, SMART, and Globe. Now what I'd like to discuss today is the options that you have when you're moving to New Zealand, specifically Auckland Central Business District. Now the top three um, mobile telecom, mobile whatever um, services or providers that we have or they have here in New Zealand is Vodafone, Two Degrees, and Telecom Mobile, which is now Spark. So these are your top three choices. There are others, but these others are actually using internet connectivity or services from these top three, um, you know, phone providers or whatever. So today, that way you, you guys don't have any more problems trying to um, check the websites or, you know, comparing it yourselves. I'm gonna compare it for you. And hopefully by the end of this video, we can actually get to a conclusion on which is actually the best plan for you and which is the cheapest plan for you know almost everybody. So guys, what are we waiting for? Let's start. So let's start with Vodafone. Let's see here, mobile, then plans with phone. Now you automatically be redirected to the Red Plus plans with the phone. You, they have three plans. Uh, $999 for 12 months uh, with 7.5 gigs of data and unlimited contacts to New Zealand and Australia. Uh, $129.99, which is 12.5 gigs of data, same for the unlimited contacts. And $149.99 for 15 gigs of data and uh, unlimited call in text for the same, you know. New Zealand and Australia. So let's choose the cheapest one, $99.99. So now we are allowed to choose a mobile device. Now one, th one mobile device that I'm actually looking to get is the Xperia XA. Now if you notice for the new phones, there is an upfront cost of roughly how much the phone actually costs. So let's look for the Xperia XA here. Hmm. This is too too expensive. iPhone 6 actually zero up front. It's a $650 phone. Hmm, nice. But of course, I already have an iPhone 6S, so might as well just get the Xperia XA. So not this Xperia X Compact. Nine dollars up front. Not willing to pay that much. Um hmm. Let's see, load more. Okay, 6S, SE, if I, iPhone SE is a free, A3, I like the A3. Yeah, hmm, tempting. There, there has to be Xperia XA here somewhere, load more, let's see. Oh, there we go, Xperia XA. No, not this one, yeah. So, it's, uh, if you notice, it's zero dollars. It's uh, $349 if you just get the phone. But if you go through the Red Plus Essentials plan with $99.99 a month, the phone becomes free. And uh, that's included in your 24 month term. So, you know, $999. About 3,500 pesos back in the Philippines. So, a bit steep. It's a bit steep compared to what we have in the Philippines. Let's see what we have for uh, two degrees. All right, so here we are the two degrees website. Um, not sure we choose mobile, there we go. 
mobile and then pay monthly pay monthly plans should be yeah there we go find out more pay monthly plans hmm galaxy s7 yeah, yeah um so do we have a lot of different plans 29.95 a month one gig data 100 cam over minutes for New Zealand and Australia. Limited data. I'm sorry, limited te call and text. I'm limited text, technically. 39.95, um, 1.5 gigs of data. Um, not too interested in that. 1.5 gigs of data is okay, but you know, it's not that much. 49.95, there's 4.5 gigs of data. It used to be 2.5, but you get an additional two gigabytes per month for two years. So, you know, if you get, get it for 24 months, the 4995 is actually a good deal. Um, unlimited context to New Zealand and Australia. And, um, you know, yada, I'm not really looking into the $10 trade up or the family share for $25. Um, if you get it for $59.95, used to be $69.95. Um, it's a $10 credit per month for two years. So from 69 is 59.95, seven gigs of data. Um, used to be five gigs, so there's plus two gig per month. Um, and if you get the 79.95, which used to be 89.95, you get 10 gigs of data, um, two gig per month for two years. Let's choose the 49.95 here because this is the most eco economic if you if you think about it. Um, okay, so we have the 4995 plan. Um, hmm. Find a two degrees phone. There we go. And, hmm, Samsung Galaxy S8. There's an upfront cost of $29, but you need to pay um, $61.25, which is kind of kind of a lot of money. Um, but, you know, it's cheaper compared to Vodafone. Um, let's see. There we go. We have the Xperia XA. Um, upfront cost of $29, $15.41 per month um, for 24 months. So basically it's the same as in the Philippines. Um, you know, a staggered payment or whatever. Um, let's see. What other phone plans? iPhone 6s, already have that. Uh, iPhone 7, not really a big fan of uh, no 3.5 millimeter um, headphone jack. Um, there's a lot of Oppos. Uh, Samsung Galaxy A3 is only $19.58 per month with $29 up front. A lot of Huawei, a lot of Huawei here. Um, iPhone 6. Eh. Camera is only 8 megapixels, so I'm not really looking into that. Um, so yeah, let's go. Still go with the Sony Xperia XA. Um, so I, I can change the upfront cost, uh, technically. Um, it's just $29. You can also change the color, um, black or white. So you can change the upfront costs from 29 to maybe, um, $39? Yeah, let's say it's $39. And that'll be $15 per month. So I'm only going to pay $64.94 per month for the next 24 months. And just an upfront cost of uh, $39. So that's about $105 initially, but you're still paying $65 a month for most, like as much as what you would be getting for Vodafone. So this is actually a more economic um toys so um, two degrees yeah pr pretty good yeah all right so here we are with spark what the fuck netflix um so spark used to be telecom mobile i know it's a very um you know obvious name so let's go shop then mobile um let's choose a phone so we have the samsung galaxy s series new ones um, iPhone 7s, uh, let's see, do you have a cheaper one, uh, 6S, 6S Plus, 5SE, uh, 5S is $20 per month, if you get the $59.99 open term, um, yeah, but, 
you know, the 5S is too obsolete. 5SE is nice for $59.99, but you can actually get it cheaper at um, 2 degrees because it's $49.95 plus, I don't know, like um, $28 for the SE. Why am I even clicking on this? Let's see. There we go. Pay monthly. There you go. All right. Now, let's choose a phone. Let's look for the Xperia XA. Yeah. Yeah, let's just try to choose the Xperia XA. That way, you know, it's going to be a level playing field. XA1? Hmm. Okay, there there we go. Um, Xperia XA, uh, $12.46 per month for 24 months. Hmm. Pretty good. Um, so we can get black um, instead of thirty-nine dollars. Uh, thirty-nine. I'm sorry, thirty-nine dollars. It's two hundred ninety-nine. So it's cheaper. Um, let's see. Open term, fifty-nine ninety-nine. Four gig data. Um, you can actually get four point five gig with two degrees at four nine ninety-five. So that's a little bit better. Um, you can switch to if you want to pay upfront. So if you can pay upfront, it's only three hundred dollars. Uh, Twenty-four months is going to be twelve forty-six, and uh, I think if you get um, twelve months, it's going to be around twenty-four, yeah, twenty-five dollars, twenty-four ninety-two per month. So uh, if you go twelve months, you'd be paying like seventy-two dollars forty-six. So, you know, it's, it's actually much better. It's a, two degrees is much cheaper. Um, let's see. There's also a 24 month plan for Spark here. Um, they have a 99.99, which is 7.5 gigs of data. So, the same thing. But you get the phone for free. So, instead of paying $72 something seventy three dollars you can pay a hundred dollars and not pay the phone which is uh, you'd be better off getting the fifty nine 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 but of course um yeah i guess at the end of the day you know two degrees is much cheaper for roughly sixty five dollars and ninety four cents something right so, yeah, there you go, two degrees mobile. There. Yep, I'm still going with uh, two degrees. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Take note, this is my own personal opinion and my needs might not be the same as your needs, but you can always go to the websites, I'll link them below for vote, vote of, uh, all Vodafone, 2 Degrees, and Spark, and you can actually check it out yourselves. So guys, I hope this helps, especially for those people who are moving from the Philippines to Auckland, New Zealand. Um, all three phone subscribers are actually on the same street, Queen Street, so you, know, you can't miss it. And guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you like it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys next time.